Greetings and welcome to 25 Plus. My name is Matthew Nolan. I'm the executive chef of Nolan Partners. Uh, the dish we're making for you right now could be a very beautiful autumnal seasonal salad of persimmon, burrata, uh, some pomegranate arrows. To finish the dish, we're going to spritz it with an atomizer of quince vinegar and a little bit of um, extra virgin olive oil. Uh, the final garnish is a gretti or saltwort, so it really brings these fall flavors together. So let's begin. Beginning with the pomegranate, that's kind of our focus. And the burrata is also our focus. Now, burrata de Stefano from Southern California. Family came here from the, in the 1930s, we're producing this amazing cheese. So what we're going to do is we're going to come over here and we're going to start with the dish by placing little bits of burrata around so that the guest isn't stuck with a giant ball of cheese. I'll take more some of on the table as well. Um, so that's about three ounces of burrata. And then the next up, we're going to take our, our persimmon that we've diced up and these little bits of Brussels sprouts that we've quartered and roasted and just kind of decorate the plate with them a little bit. This is the fun part, you know, in the, uh, in the classical French kitchen, this is called the salade composé, so not a mixed salad or just a basic regular salad, but we've actually taken the pieces and sort of broken them apart from one another so that they can live on the dish. Now, in the restaurant kitchen, we use we put these things into plastic bottles so that people don't break them. Um, this is a little extra virgin olive oil. This is one of those finishing oils. You don't want to use a basic pure olive oil. You don't really want that fruitiness from the olive oil to match with everything else. And if you go to your local bottle store or whatever, you can find these atomizers. This is filled with the quince vinegar that we've made, literally by just taking quince and pureeing it, letting it ferment a little bit, and then beginning with a neutral white wine vinegar. I'm gonna spritz a little bit of this. So it's kind of like the idea of making a vinaigrette, but that's also deconstructed. So now you have the flavor of quince with that acidity to brighten the salad. So lastly, we have the agretti to the dish. It's a salty, briny uh, finish that is texturally fun and flavors match really well with the Brussels sprouts, the pomegranate, the persimmons, and everything else. Um, we serve this one at the restaurant. A uh, lot of different options as far as wine pairings, but my favorite is sparkling wine or champagne, uh, preferably the Blanc de Blanc style, so you capture that citrus, not too yeasty, and really showcases the flavors in the dish, but also doesn't compete uh, with the champagne itself or the sparkling wine if you prefer. Um, and that's it, so a little bubbly and some persimmons and burrata. Enjoy. Enjoy.